Dance Saturday, and we are live on CBBC. Yes, we're live, cockers, we're over. Yes, that's the camera. We're live, live in DD Do. We're live, I tell you, live. Hacker. What? Should we, uh, should we tell them what's coming up this morning? Yeah, I was just proving that we're live. Oh, See you brilliant, around the plasma. Yeah. See you in the plasma. Cockle. Yep, yeah, coming up this morning, you've got another chance to see last night's episode of Friday Download, starring me, so you don't want to miss that one. And coming up after that, we've got the last in the series of The Next Step, which is uh, going to be a great episode if you've not already seen it. You might want to catch up on that. And after that, if we don't spoil you enough, we've got School for Stars, so it's going to be a great morning. Stick around, and there's loads of ways for you guys to get involved. Yes, like having me sing my favourite song from the mid-90s. Can I, Joe, hit it? No, 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 no. <laughs> Sorry, music. Sorry, music. We'll save that for later. Hacker, um, what, what the, the guys have already got involved. They've been emailing in telling us what they're getting up to today. Hooray! Let's, so let's shout them out. Let's do it. Out of the first one. There we are, yes. <laughs> this is from Zircon Loopy Fox, and they say, I love pizza. So do I, Cocker. It's like posh cheese on toast. It was slick, that. And this one from Cerise Sparkly Bobcat. Please shout out to my friend Sophie and wish her a happy birthday. Thanks, happy birthday. Lovely. This was sent by Sapphire Barking Princess. And they say, shout out to my 21 pets, including 14 chickens, one rabbit, two fish, one dog, two cats, and one girl snake called Ralph. Merry Christmas. <laughs> that is a lot of pets. Uh, and this last one from Katie. I'd like to say a happy World Cup to all the England supporters and happy Father's Day to my dad for tomorrow. Happy Father's Day for tomorrow, Katie's dad. And um, all the other dads. Yeah. But thank you so much for getting involved. But there's still loads more ways for you guys problem, to join in at home. Yeah, there is. Because we want your break faces. Yeah, that's right. Get your breakfast, turn it into a face, take a picture and send it in to us at shoutouts at bbc.co.uk. Always in front of me and every week. Yes, but not only that, Cocker, a little later, we're going to be doing a new item called Help! My grown-up is awake. There's no scarier than a mum or dad's morning face, you know. You're right. So get a parent, uh, get a parent, what am I talking about? <laughs> get a, we're live! Get a photo of your parent's morning face and send it in to us. But do get permission from said parent and our guardian. Yeah, very well remembered, Hacker. Make sure you get permission and include a home phone number. Yes, home phone number, please. No permission, no inclusion in the sending. That is just true. But right now, it's time for Friday Download. Hey! That was Friday Download, and this is live Shout Out Saturday. It sure is, me old cockers. Yes, indeedy do. Oh, Shannon, I'm hungry for some breakfast uh, faces that look a little bit like um, faces, in a way, <laughs> made out of cereal and that. Well, you're in luck, because we're doing... Bread faces. faces! Leave a beat. Let's Move go. <laughs> Let me, there, Let me squeeze past you there, oh. man. Yes, basically, you guys have been sending in your breakfast that look like faces. So without further ado, let's have a closer look at some. Let's! The first one was sent in by Chloe, and it's got a donutty eyes and a lovely nose made of egg, and a grin that's forced from cereal. Oh, that was a really, really lovely song, Hacker. I it, love the song, yeah. and I also love a good bagel. I said However, donut, I messed it up, didn't yeah. I? <laughs> but this Bagel, where's the spread? Where's it's the so spread? Dry. It's gone. Anyway, this next one from George is a lovely little boiled egg man. Look at his face, he's got a ramekin for a thorax and dipping bread for limbs, yeah. Dipping bread, and I like the old ramekin. Thorax thing, that's nice. I knew you would. Uh, this next one from Ruby. What do you think of that one happened? Oh, wow, I say Ruby sent in some toast with eggs, and by Jingo, he's got a brown sauce monobrow. A brown sauce monobrow? Are you sure it's not a smile or a mustache? No, it's a scouse brown sauce. A scouse brown sauce, amazing. I loved it. Thank you so much for sending in your breakfasts, guys. We love them, but you can still get involved because we want you to send in your pics of help my grown-ups awake. Yes, we want to see the pictures of your grubby grown-ups, your dirty dads and your messy mums. Show us your grubby grown-ups. So send a photo of them in, in their dressing gowns with crazy hair, quirky eyes, dribbling mush, and email your pictures in to shoutout at bbc.co.uk and we'll show them later, but do get permission. Yep, and include a phone at home number if that makes sense. But yes, right now it's time for the next step. Lovely work. Hello, you're watching live Shout Out Saturday and it is 10.29 with me, Shannon, and him, Hacker. Hacker G-Dog, please, but you could call me Sir Hacker. Sir Hacker, well, you're not a knight, are you? 
I know, it's daytime. Night and day, do you get it? Bit of bad. Move on. Anyway, I think it's time that we did Help! My grown-ups away! Yeah. Oh yes, yes. grubby grown-ups, my favourite sort of viewing. It is indeed, should we have a look at some pictures? Let's. Let's have a look. This one is Katie's mum, Claire. Oh look, her hair's a skew cocker, but she looks happy to be up at this hour. She does. It's early, isn't it? She's got a big grin. <laughs> Let's have a look at the next one. And this one is Jude's dad, Chris. Oh, look at him, he's an angry man. He looks I'm not fuming. surprised, though. He's been woke up so early. And look there, just behind the scene, there's a pig with a hat on. A pig with a hat on? Nice, nice spot there. That's what I think won't catch on. It's um, not very catchy. His next one uh, is Grace's mum, Melissa. Now, she looks like she's not even seen the picture being taken here. I know, she's aghast. She's peering at a dog. Who looks the spits of me? He looks just like you. I can do that, watch. <gasps> That's a good impression. That's a good impression. Oh, very nice, Hacker. Hey, you two could be related. That's me, Uncle Terry. I oh, recognise this. Is it? Tom. Is it? Nice. Yeah. Thank you for all of your amazing pictures of help my grown ups awake. But you can still get involved with. CBBC Brain Box! Yes, you can. If you reckon you could beat Molly from Crawley's score of nine, which is very high, uh, if you do think that, then why not email in shoutout at bbc.co.uk and tell us why you are CBBC's biggest super fan. Oh, you'll never beat nine. Nine's a good score. Nine oh. is a good score, but if you want to get involved and you want to beat that score, then make sure you get permission and include your home phone number. Yeah, actually, you know, I'm CBBC's biggest super fan. I know everything about CBBC. Oh, do you? Yeah. What, what's coming on next? Uh, hackers gardening nightmares. It's school for stars. Same thing. Yeah. Here it is. Good morning, Rockets Island is coming up next, but first it's time for... This! If it hadn't been for Cotton Eye Joe. No! Hacker, no! Stop the music. We'll Listen, do later. we haven't we'll do got later. time for Cotton Eye Joe. Oh. Let's pack it in. Right, okay, because we're doing this. CBBC Brain Box. I like that as well. It was glorious, yes. I reckon we've got a caller on the line who reckons it can be Molly's score of nine from Crawley. Oh. So, have we got a caller? Is it Mia on the line? Hiya. Hi, Mia. How are you? Good, thanks. It's Mia from Bromley. All right, cocker. Good. <laughs> She's good. And what have you been getting up to on this Saturday morning? I've been watching CBBC. Good, good choice. Good choice. And uh, why are you CBBC's biggest super fan? Because I've been watching CBBC since I was three and I answer all the questions correctly every week. <gasps> well, I think we could have a new uh, a new champ then with that fighting talk. And I also hear a little birdie told me that you can do a good impression of Hacker. Yeah. Go on then, let's hear it. All right, Cockers. Oh, it sounds good. You have to come in and I'll have a day off. I'll go to Wigan and you can do my job. Hey, you've got to stay here. You've got to help me. Oh, well, basically, OK. So I'm going to give you 60 seconds, Mia, to answer as many of these questions as you can. For every question that you get correctly, you'll get one second of time to shout out to your friends and family at home. Does that sound good? Yep. OK, OK. Can I get 60 seconds on the clock, please? It's on. It's on. It's on. OK, well, Hacker, can you count us in? Sure can. Three, two, one. Brain box, go. Question one. Name the dog to my left. Hacker. Yes, right. quite correct. Question two. True or false? Dennis the Menace has a dog named Nasha. True. True, correct. Question three. Who is Hacker impersonating? Hello, I live Dr. Who and that is still good, isn't it? Chris. Come yes, on. special book. <laughs> Which off. news show has a sports correspondent called Gary Ogden? DNN. DNN, yes. Special five. Can you shout out Saturday? Yes. Shout Saturday. Shout out Saturday. Yes. Question six. What animal is Hacker doing an impression of? <laughs> A dolphin. Yes! Question seven, name a blue pizza presenter. Lindsay. Yes! Question eight, what theme tune is Hacker singing? Officially amazing! Officially amazing. Yes! Question nine, which of these is not a real CBBC show? Tracy Beaker or Tracy Beekeeper? Tracy Beekeeper. Correct! Correct. Question ten, complete the title of this show, Rockets. 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 Oh, I no. Rocket Island. Oh, we were just. Oh, we'll give it, yeah. yeah. We're going to give it yeah because it was Rocket oh, Island and she's got ten. ten. Which means you're top of the leaderboard and you get ten seconds to shout out to your friends and family at home. So let's have ten seconds on the clock, please. Okay, we might you might get cut off, but it's been lovely speaking to you, Mia. You too. Here we go. Three, two, one. Shout out. Go. I like to shout out to my friends at school, my friends at my dance school, my mum, my dad, my brother, my sister, my three cats, and my hamster. 
Oh, you have blocked Annie. her. Annie. And everyone, else, everyone I know, everyone Annie. who I live with. Yes. Oh, oh. Mia. Very good. You did Ten. amazing. Ten seconds was so good. Thank you so much for getting involved, Mia. But if you guys at home want to get involved still, then why not email in your shout-outs too? Shout-outs at bbc.co.uk. Tell us who you are, where you are, and what you're getting up to today. But what are you getting up to, Hacker? I'm going to bleed me radiators. Oh, that's really nice. Here's Rockets Island. <laughs> What an amazing episode of Rockets Island there. And whoops, I missed the bus. is coming up next. Oh, I love that show, Cocker, but never mind that now. It's time for some shout-outs. It oh. is indeed. Let's do it. This first one from Matilda. I'm going to bake a cake and go swimming with my sister and her friend. Really? This one's from Sam who says, shout-out to my sister, Becky. How nice. Ginger musical tomato. Can you give a shout-out to my best, best, best friend, Evie, on her gymnastics competition? Good luck. Good luck. This was sent in by Jess who says, shout-out to my cousin, Emma. It was her birthday yesterday. Oh, I had a birthday for yesterday. This one from Matilda. I'm playing football with my bunny, who's an awesome player. No! And this was set in by Indigo Disco Parakeet, who says, I would like to say happy birthday for tomorrow to me, Dad, and I hope England win the football. Oh, me too. Um, thank you for all your amazing shout-outs. We've had a lovely morning, haven't we? It's but been right top-notch. Here's Whoops, I Missed the Bus. Lovely work. <laughs> Did you enjoy it, Shannon? I did, I had a really nice morning, did you, Hacker? I thought it was average, Cocker, particularly your bits. Oh, 